Bunny, are you alive? Yeah. He's stress eating. Bunny, it's gonna be okay. It's gonna be okay, Bunny. I'm charging the fan with the generator thing. You know, so we can have some air when mommy gets back from her daily run. Good morning. Anyway, you guys, um, today I'm getting my hair done. At the time of recording, I didn't have power, but now I have power. Today is Thursday. I got my power back Tuesday night. So I went five days without power after the tornado that hit um, Houston. So anyway, I'm just gonna be doing these ribbon braids. Um, it's the I'm in Japan braids, that's what I call them. Like the little I'm in Japan braids. Like that's what I wore for my I'm in Japan music video. But I'm doing them dumb long. And of course, I gotta add the ribbon. I'm feeling a little extra today, so I actually had her tie ribbons like around the ponytail. But yeah, I'm gonna clip my bangs in when I get home because she don't really mess with like hair glue and stuff. So she's like more of a braider, but. So hey you guys, I'm back with the long awaited makeup video. I just had so many weird things happening. Like, you know, I had a power outage because there was a freaking tornado that hit Houston and like knocked out all the power. And I had no power for five days. And then I had a visitor and all this stuff. So I'm, I, you know, guys already told you guys this. So it's like, I just finally, you know, and I got my hair done. I had to wait for that. So now I can finally get this makeup video out. And I got these little ribbon I'm in Japan braids. So yeah, I did my bangs myself. My stylist, she's like really against using hair glue, like using hair glue for your hair. So I just did it myself, but I did it a little differently. Like I found these old tracks from my, that one long black hair dude. And I was like, Ugh. and I cut it and I'm like, oh, let me leave that little piece on the side. Like remember when I tried to dye my hair ginger last year and that's why I went bald headed so all of the ginger hair broke off so I'm pretty much natural so like my bangs are a little it's kind of hard to keep them to stay straight because I'm natural I have a fro now Woo so yeah but anyway please comment um you know hair colors I should do because I'm not gonna do black hair for long now I'm doing a crazy color next time so please comment um, what color I should do next. I have a color in mind, but I would like to hear you guys' suggestions. So get into my hair and my outfit. I'm gonna be a magical girl today. And that's why I got this outfit on. Um, I tried to do like a magical girl outfit. It's kind of pink and I don't know. I'm just, I'm just, I really have been getting heavy into makeup. Like, please, please check out my new Instagram page. I made an Instagram page just for makeup looks. Like I'm really getting into the makeup stuff, like seriously. So I've been posting a lot of them. I'm not the best and it requires a lot of editing and stuff. I don't know if you guys have noticed my editing and stuff, but like, I'm really trying to get into that. So please check me out on Instagram. And I don't know what contacts to wear for this look. I wanna wear the contacts that I got. Remember the contact from the Taco Bell um, makeup look? I want to wear these like crazy contacts, but I can't see in them. So I'm gonna put in like a different pair as just like a stand-in for now. So I can see, but you guys can still like see like the vibes. Cause I want to do like these pink kind of anime sparkly vibe ones. You cannot see in these, like I can't like, look, it has like a white film over the pupil. So like, I'm not going to wear them right now, but these are the contacts that I do plan on wearing later. And my nails are not grown out. I don't know. She, these are press on and she never, um, she never paints like to the bottom, I don't know. I was trying to tell her, but I don't want to be annoying because I already have so much stuff going on in my nails. It just kind of sounds petty, like, but they do look kind of gross and grown out. But yeah, look at the contacts, like you can't see. So that I'm gonna put another pair in that's similar. Just, you know, so you guys can see whatever. I 
just put on my red anime contacts that I've really been rocking with lately. Like, I really, really like these a lot. I don't know. And remember, we used to think these were so scary. Now they're like my favorite. And I'm gonna clip my bangs to the side. Shout out to you, Sakura, the girl from the uh, music video I did in Japan for giving me these hair clips because they're actually very useful. <laughs> like, especially when you have a bang. Yeah, and I also got my eyebrows waxed. I did them pretty thin, but I wish I kind of did them thinner, but I digress. First, we're just gonna start off with this color corrector. You guys already know I have hyperpigmentation really bad. Like I have it on my thighs, I have it on my face. I believe it's from insulin resistance because nothing makes it go away. That's what I be talking about, the diabetes stuff. But yeah, I'm just gonna put it under my eyes and around my, my chin and stuff so we can color correct. I got a new one. This one's like really, really strong. Like this one's like really pigmented. So yeah, I finished putting on my foundation. My skin doesn't look gray thanks to the color corrector, so I'm happy about that. Now I'm just going in with this concealer and just concealing just around my mouth, under my eyes, just any spots that are either discolored. I don't really have blemishes, but I do have discoloration. Sorry, I'm on the phone, <sighs> y'all. I'm never gonna have, I'm never gonna have any man. I'm just done, sorry, I can't, I'm done. I'm never gonna do that man thing again. What was I thinking with a man, you stupid gal? Happy to be back on my grind, doing my things. I, I don't need all that energy right now. Jalen go crazy. crazy. I'm just gonna go in with my lighter concealer and this is like so old I literally had this for like 10 years and I'm just gonna conceal like it's like highlight concealer I don't know what you call it highlight because when people think of highlight you think of the powder highlighter the shimmer but this is the highlight concealer. I don't know what you call it I just highlighted my face with concealer go in and put this liquid blush on I don't know I think the color is too light I've never used liquid blush but I've been seeing a lot of I put it on, I put it on like after I did my makeup and it literally made my makeup so patchy. So I'm gonna like do it while like before I use my beauty blender, if that makes any sense. And just pat it on my cheeks and places I want it to be a little reddish, like my nose. If you guys can really see it i think next time i buy one i want to buy a different like a darker color because i don't really see much but yeah you bitches on instagram are some liars i'm never gonna put the cream blush on after i set my face and do my makeup nope Jaylen go crazy. i'm just gonna blend that all in with my beauty blender You can kind of see the blush there. I'm just gonna set my entire face with this brown powder. I never used to do that, but I'm always doing little new different things. Like I swear my beauty page has really helped me like just try new things and stop being so scared because I do my makeup. Like I probably do my makeup every day, you know? So it's like, might as well take pictures. I'm going with this light translucent powder and I'm just gonna like put this on the areas that I really want to be like bright and pop, like under my eyes and stuff. 
Guys, I freaking forgot to contour my nose with the liquid contour concealer. I knew everything was going too smooth. I knew I forgot something. Freaking got powder on my nose. Whatever, I'm just tired, bro. Now I'm gonna contour just with um, powder. And I'm gonna put a little bit more because I didn't use a liquid contour. Yeah, I messed up. I put way too much contour because I was trying to overcompensate because I didn't put on liquid contour and I messed my face up. See, that always happens. Everything was going good and now everything's looking a hot mess. God dang it. Whatever, now I gotta blend this out and try to figure it out. Guys, I freaking ruined my makeup. My nose looks like crap. Okay, I'm gonna try to fix it. I'm gonna try to put setting powder and like try to like fix it because I, I, I messed it up bad. I don't know, bro. It's still looking kind of bad. So I'm gonna go in with this red eyeshadow. I just use eyeshadow as blush and just, I just use eyeshadow for anything. And I'm gonna contour like on top of it with red. I've been doing that a lot lately and it's actually better. Like it gives it more of like, like when I do like my powder contour, it gives it more of like a, like more, I don't know, pigmented. It gives it more dimension. Like it just looks more like just dimension, not ashy. You know what I mean? Okay, so what the fuck are we doing? Oh, we're gonna do blush, baby. We're gonna do blush. I've been I've been really researching makeup and stuff, and I've been getting a lot of like makeup videos on my Instagram. And like I don't really know what to do. I don't know what to do with my blush. I don't know if I should do like my anime blush. I don't know if I should do like red, pink. The blush is everything, baby. This is a magical girl makeup look. The blush is everything. like it's better to like pat the blush on like i'll like get like a really big amount of blush i'll just like put a lot on my brush and just like pat pat like just on each cheek like that i don't know put some on my chin too it just makes it like more of a magical girl cute um look to your face i'm gonna blush out my eyes as well it just gives it more of a cute Magical girl look to your face. Moving on to the highlighter shimmer slash glitter. So I have a couple products here. I have this cream eyeshadow shimmer that I use. Um, I kind of stack my shimmer highlighter when I go to highlight my face. Then I have like this liquid highlighter and I'm actually using a brush from a different liquid highlighter for this liquid highlighter because that brush is way too thick and this is very very pigmented so i like to use a very little brush for this because it's a little bit goes a very long way sorry where you at So I'm, I mainly just highlight my nose, but I just use my, you know, handy dandy hands, my fingers to, um, you know, uh, blend it out. See, my nails are not grown out. It's just the way she, cause I like to paint the bottoms of my nails a different color. I don't know, I just like to do that. Oh, 
oh, my highlighter is pretty much done. I just mainly do my nose. And you know what I also like to do? I like to take a little bit of um, this pink shimmer, kind of like rose gold powder and put it on my nose as well for highlighter. Ah. Uh, I just do that. It just gives it like a nice, you know, highlight. And now I'm just gonna go in with the eyeshadow since we have the eyeshadow palette out anyway. I'm gonna do my eyeshadow. So I just started off with doing my little eye bags. It just creates like a more like bigger, cute eye look. So I just did my little eye bags underneath my eye. And now I'm gonna go in with this light pink uh, shimmer. Wait, no, this is not light pink shimmer. I'm gonna go in with this red, this dark red. And I'm gonna like, go over the eye back thing I just did. And I'm gonna do like my under outer corner with that. Now I'm gonna do like a pink makeup look. I'm gonna do like a pink eyeshadow look um, on my upper lid. Like I did like a pink look. I don't know if you guys can really see. And I'm gonna go in with this little purple color and do like a cut crease on top. Because I had the black hair and whatnot, I wasn't really wearing eyeshadow, but it's like, I really love eyeshadow. You just have to take your time with it. That's the only thing about eyeshadow. You really just gotta take your time, but when you do, it really makes a difference. So I'm gonna go on my upper lid and add like a little like shimmery streak, like in the middle. Like sometimes to make it like look very shiny and just pretty, you can just add like shimmer just in the middle of your eye and it makes it look like really pretty. So that's what I did. I don't know what it looks like right now. It doesn't look too special. Now that I'm watching this, I'm like, I probably could have went a little darker with the colors, but mm, it's okay. I might have to buy some new makeup because, like, I need... No, I don't need to buy anything. Okay, I'm good. Oh so I'm going to go in with this shimmer um, little... What is this? Liquid highlighter. And I'm going to go in with my outer corner. It's white. And I'm going to just go um, put it on top of my outer corners. I like to put like either a really light cream color or pink in my outer corners or my inner corners because it just makes your eyes look more like just bigger and cute. I don't know. And I messed up really bad. Of course, um, whatever, it's my life. Anyway, went on to the eyeliner. So I'm just gonna do like a cute short wing. I did it off camera because this requires me to focus. I, I can't be messing up, like I need to focus for once. So I just did like a cute little short wing. And then I'm gonna do um, some eyeshadow, some dark eyeshadow um, underneath my eye, just to give it more of like a magical girl anime look. I just mixed brown and red underneath my eye and it's real cute. <laughs> going with this white eyeshadow and I'm just gonna like add a little bit of final touches just going around my eyes with white just to brighten up certain spots like the inner corners and like underneath a little bit like there under that red part I did that dark part <laughs> pretty much it for the eyes I actually really like the way they turned out like yeah they're really cute and I'm gonna go in with this red lip liner and I'm just gonna move on to my lips. So I'm gonna go over that red lip liner with this um, dark brown. And I'm just gonna go in with this matte kind of pink peach nude, um, cream lipstick, matte lipstick. Oh yeah, and of course we need lip gloss. Like this is like my favorite. I actually went without lip liner for a while, but 
lip gloss i need that so i don't know if i should use this light pink color or this my favorite one that red looking one hold on there's some plastic on it like i just bought this like these are brand new i just bought this light pink one it's like my favorite lip gloss so i always have to like rebuy it all the time and it's really light it's kind of frosty you know i know the frosty pink lip is like kind of ashy looking but i just love it so to make it a little less like ashy looking i'm gonna just go in with the red i kind of just like mix and layer my lip glosses honestly Sorry, anyway, enough of that. So um, we're pretty much done with the makeup. I'm just gonna add um, some glitter because I am a magical girl. So we have to be like mad sparkly and just glittery and just, you already know, extra. <sighs> I love glitter. I just don't wear it all the time because like, you, you, you know, too much of a good thing can be bad. So this is pretty much the final makeup look. So yeah, let me just fix my bangs. Let me unclip them. And let's see the whole look with the hair put together. Uh, I left a bend in my hair. I put so much spritz on this bang. I fried it real bad. Cause you guys know I'm natural. I, I forgot, I didn't know. I haven't even worn my hair out in like six months. So anyway, let me put my little flat iron up. So you guys, this is the finished product. So what do you think of my magical gal transformation wood video ting? Oh, I got a wedgie. So yeah, this was really fun to do. I'm so happy I got these long pigtails because now I can do like, you know, like these little, like I'm gonna do a lot of like super extravagant, cute, girly, girly, girly looks with this hair. Like I just feel like the pigtails just give me magical gal cause they're just so long and I don't know, like theatrical, like my hair is so cute. She really did a good job in the back. Like, look at the way the ribbons crisscross. Just so cute. I love this hairstyle. I love it. And it's actually pretty good for my hair, minus my, like, bangs. It's because it's braids, you know? So that's why my hair has really been able to grow. It's just been braided for a long time. Oh, yeah, I forgot. I need to change these contacts out. These actually aren't the contacts I wanted to wear for this look. The contacts I want to wear are, like, really extravagant. So let me go pop them in. 
So these are the contacts that I was talking about earlier. I just can't see in them. But yeah, this is now giving magical girl. Like, come on, you guys. What do you guys think? Like, I can't wait to do more makeup videos. I'm so happy my power's on and I could just get back to just doing fun things, music, whatever. Like, oh my gosh. I have so many things I want to do. Choreography. I have songs I want to drop. I just, it's just been so many freaking weird things, bro. Like I've had these contacts since the Taco Bell trial and all, and I haven't really worn them, like did a look with them. So I'm happy to finally be able to do something with them. much the finished product so what do you guys think this was so fun to do this was like super duper cute and creative and i can't wait to do more All right, you guys, I'm in the middle of doing my dance, but I, it's my neighbor's birthday. She's the one who helped me survive this power outage in Texas. So I'm gonna give her her birthday gift. It's hot, boy, and I'm not done. And if I don't finish before the sun's down, I guess I ain't gonna finish. I think I'm pretty good, but let's see. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Ashley. Happy birthday to you. But anyway, you guys, happy birthday, Ashley. She really saved my life with those generators, like, during this tornado thing. Like, I'm so shocked, like... I don't really like to ask people for help and like she just like I didn't even ask her she just like you know just like was like yeah you can come get my generator da, 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 da. like I know it's small but like that that really was like a big deal like she really like saved my life with that like this power outage thing like I was not prepared for that and like wow so happy birthday Ashley thank you so much I would not have survived <sighs> that power outage without you Wow.